Looking for ways to stay cool during the sweltering summer days without relying on traditional air conditioning? Join us at MacMinds Hub and let's jump right in! Ventilator fans are a smart way to make your home feel cooler. It works by moving air from the cooler parts of your home, like the basement or ground floor, to the warmer areas, usually upstairs. This mixing of air helps balance the temperature throughout your house. Imagine it like this. If you have a cold drink and a hot drink and you pour them together, you get a drink that's just right. Window treatments like blackout curtains and reflective window films are a clever way to keep your home cool. Blackout curtains are thick curtains that don't let sunlight through. When you close them, they keep your rooms dark and cool. Reflective window films are like sunglasses for your windows. You stick them on the glass and they bounce the sun's rays back outside. This means less heat gets into your house. Cross ventilation is a natural method to keep your home cool and fresh. It involves opening windows or doors across two opposite ends of a space, allowing air to flow in from one side and out the other. This movement of air creates a breeze that can help reduce the temperature inside your home and improve air quality by pushing out stale air and bringing in fresh outdoor air. It's an effective, energy-saving way to ventilate your house, especially during warm weather. Evaporative coolers, often called swamp coolers, are devices that cool air through the simple process of evaporation. It works by pulling hot, dry air through water-soaked pads. As the air moves through the pads, the water evaporates and absorbs heat, which lowers the air's temperature. The cooler air is then circulated into the space, reducing the overall temperature. These coolers are energy efficient and work best in dry climates, where the air has low humidity. They are a cost-effective alternative to traditional air conditioning, especially in areas where the air is usually hot and dry. Evaporative coolers are also more environmentally friendly since they use water and air instead of refrigerants. The humidifiers are useful appliances that help make your home more comfortable by reducing humidity. High humidity can make the air feel warmer than it actually is. By removing excess moisture from the air, the humidifiers help the air feel cooler. This can be especially helpful during hot and humid summer months. These devices work by drawing in air and passing it over a refrigerated coil, which condenses the moisture in the air into water. This water is collected in a tank and the drier cooler air is released back into the room. The humidifiers can also prevent mold growth and reduce allergens in your home. Looking at a DIY solution, an ice bowl fan is a simple, homemade air conditioner. Here's how it works. Take a bowl filled with ice and place it in front of an electric fan. When you turn the fan on, it blows air over the ice. This air becomes cooler as it passes over the ice cubes. Then, this chilled air spreads around the room, lowering the room's temperature. It's a quick and inexpensive way to cool down a space on hot days. While it's not as powerful as a real air conditioner, it can provide some relief from the heat using items you likely already have at home. Digging deeper, underground cooling is a smart way to keep buildings cool. The idea is to use spaces below the ground, like basements or cellars, where the Earth's temperature is naturally cooler than the air above ground. In summer, when it's hot outside, underground areas can be much cooler. This is because the Earth acts like a big insulator, absorbing and holding onto the cold. By building living spaces or storage areas underground, you can take advantage of this natural cooling effect. It's an eco-friendly option that doesn't need electricity, making it both cost-effective and good for the planet. Focusing on the outdoors, shade landscaping is a smart way to make your home cooler and more comfortable during hot weather. By planting trees and shrubs, you create natural shade. This shade not only makes outdoor spaces more enjoyable, but also helps lower the temperature around your home. Trees like maples or oaks grow large and can block sunlight from hitting your house directly. 
shrubs, especially those planted near windows, can also provide cooling shade. This natural cooling can reduce the need for air conditioning, saving energy and money. Plus, these plants improve air quality and support local wildlife, making your garden a little ecosystem. Remember to choose plants that are well suited to your area's climate and soil for the best results. Cool roofing is a great way to keep your house cooler and save on energy costs. It involves using special roofing materials that reflect sunlight instead of absorbing it. This means less heat gets into your home. Think of it like wearing a light-colored t-shirt on a sunny day. It keeps you cooler than a dark one would. By reflecting more sunlight, these roofs don't get as hot, which can lower the temperature inside your home. This can be especially helpful in hot climates. Not only does it make your home more comfortable, but it also means you might use less air conditioning, saving energy and money. Plus, it's good for the environment because it helps reduce the heat island effect in cities. Getting into the nitty-gritty thermal mass is like a sponge for heat. It's using materials in your home that can soak up heat when it's warm and then release it when it's cooler. During the day, these materials absorb heat from the sun, which keeps your house from getting too hot. At night, they slowly release the stored heat, which can help keep your house warmer when the temperature drops. This is really useful because it can make your home more comfortable and reduce the need for heating and cooling systems. Common materials used for thermal mass include concrete, bricks, and stone. Adding a touch of magic, face change materials or PCMs are like magic ingredients in your home that help control the temperature. They work by changing from solid to liquid and back again at certain temperatures. When it gets hot, these materials absorb a lot of heat as they melt, which helps keep your home cooler. Then, when it cools down, they turn back into a solid and release the heat they stored. This can be really handy for keeping your home at a comfortable temperature without using as much energy for heating or cooling. PCMs can be used in walls, floors, and even ceilings to help manage the indoor climate naturally. Solar chimneys are a clever way to cool your home naturally. They work like a big straw for your house, pulling hot air up and out. When the sun heats the air inside a chimney, the air rises because warm air goes up. As it rises, it pulls cooler air into your home from windows or doors. This movement of air helps to cool down your home without using fans or air conditioning. It's like having a breeze inside your house. Solar chimneys can be really effective, especially in places where it's sunny most of the time. What do you think about these alternative cooling solutions? Share them in the comments below. And if you found these tips helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.